fourth official. Here's a team sheet now for Magadji High in goal, J. Roy James, Giovanni Findlay, Dante Blair, Akeem Rangley, Chadwick Jackson, Shawnee Daly, Roshane Lewis, Oswain Miller, Jerain Robinson, Daniel Martin, and Rabina Barge. They're coached by Xavier Hendricks. They'll be playing with a 4-3-3 formation, Magati High. Daniel Martin, their leading goal scorer with two goals. Rabina Barrett off the mark with one as well. And look out for the creativity of Roshane Lewis, who has two assists. Here's the team sheet for Roger Clark. Their goalkeepers were Con Powell, Taquan Hansen, Roshane Malcolm, Dante Blake, Deshaun Wright, Jamali Wilson, Adiana Poiser, Kimani McLean, Anthony McDonald, Rodane McDaniel, and Jordan Akins, coached by Errol White. 4-2-3-1. Here are the full match highlights. Started, the goal scoring started in the 17th minute. This ball played out wide, Rubina Barrett. Blasted it by the goalkeeper. That was his first. And he fired home with a plum. Rubina Barrett had the flips as well. That was goal number one. It would continue, the 20th minute. Advancing was Barrett. He pushed forward with great pace. And the goalkeeper didn't come, fell fortuitously to the post. And yes, Miller finished with fury. Aswain Miller opened his account in the 20th minute. Slid on the grass. Once more, Miller getting that pass, beating the goalkeeper at his near post. That's goal number two. Goal number three would come. Number four, rather, would come in the 51st minute. Poor work there from the goalkeeper. And uh, Robinson, Jerain Robinson, was always a try and always fighting. And finally, he got uh, his name on the score sheet. The 60th minute, another goal. Advancing was Lewis, the number 10. And what a finish it was. It was so clean, it almost fooled me, Chris Taylor. Yeah, look there, not even the net rattled. It was a clean strike, and he too had flicks. The 64th minute, another goal. Magati, it was really one-way traffic. What a run from this man. Lois, again, easy does it. And this time, the net rattled. And that was his second of the afternoon in the 64th minute. And they were in Easy Street, Magati High School, the 66th minute. He now proved provider. Lewis, look at this ball, sent it across. Martin skipped it. And a Jackson, the sports max at moment, fired it in with fury. Great strike that. Absolutely fantastic strike. This was the moment there was a penalty. Miller played it on, handled it. And the captain, Martin, stepped up and converted easily. And that was the end of scoring. All goals to Magati. Here are the full-time match statistics. 36 shots for Magati, only one for Roger Clark. 16 of those on target, none for Roger Clark. Three fouls for Mag Magati, eight for Roger Clark. Two yellow cards for Roger Clark, one for Mag Magati. Seven offsides, nine corners, all going to Magati. 88% of the possessions of the possession for Magati and eight goals for the good. We go to Gerard. He's with the water man of the match. Thank you so much, Dean. I'm here with the water man of the match, Martin, the number 13 man for Magati. Let me just ask you this question quickly. If you were to sum up your team's performance, if you were to sum up your team's performance, how would you say the game went for you all, for you all today? Uh, the game went good. I am not. No, you. Uh, the game went good. Uh, both teams play. Both teams play really well. And we, we just do what we have to do. Yeah, so thank you so much. Well done to you. And uh, hopefully your team can get more wins coming going on in this yeah. competition. Yes, absolutely. Yeah. Uh, that was a man of the match there. Martin, and I was have a, a chat with Coach White. 
coach, uh, obviously not the result that you would have wanted. However, you did say at the start of the broadcast that it is all about uh, rebuilding and, and learning. How much do you think your team has learned today? Well, um, firstly, congratulations to the other team. Um, we did not manage the game as well as we should, um, especially in the 1B1 situation. And therefore, collectively, we did not defend well either. We were always, you know, behind the ball, chasing. But I think it's a learning curve for us, and so, you know, I think they have learned something from it. All right, Coach. Well, we'll see you for the rest of the season. Thank you so much. Yeah, well, that was Coach Earl White there. Let's have a coach a chat now with Coach Xavier from Magati. Coach, you, this is the result that you would have wanted now. You get a win, get to your, you move up to fourth place now, joint fourth place on points. Uh, do you think now this is where the season starts and you can only get better from here? Yeah, we're hoping that it gets better from here. I think once the guys put in more work and work hard and quick on the field, I think it should get a better result in the other games to come. Yeah, what was the brightest moment for you in this game? Well, I thought when we moved the number 10 out wide, and I thought we created the opportunities there, and he came out and brought, brought some life into the game for us. All right, Coach, well, congratulations, and thank you so much. All right, thanks.